Hey everybody, it's Craig here from Mainstream Mountain Guy and Curated.com doing a short and sweet ski review on the uh, Ranger 102 by Fisher Skis. Um, got the skis, I actually put about uh, six or seven days on these skis already. So I uh, really um, got a lot of experience on them and I feel like I've really got to know them quite well. It's a super fun ski um, with pretty good um, rocker tip and tail with just a little bit of metal in the middle that kind of feathers out um, and takes up about a third of the ski. I'm skiing the 184, which um, I'm only five foot eight, so that might be a little long, but I like long skis. And um, especially for this ski, as I'm uh, moving away from kind of a mantra, kind of a heavy full metal um, jacket ski to one that has just a little bit of metal in it and is a little more playful. Um, I think it's a good, I think it's a good in-between ski, a good kind of one ski quiver for uh, everyday riding, especially here in the Rockies. It is uh, not too heavy, um, but it's also really not that flimsy. As I'm skiing it fast and I'm making big turns on groomers or hard snow, um, the tips, um, you'll see them dance around a little bit but it doesn't seem to affect um, the edge grip or the stability of the ski. Where the um, ski really grabs and, and rips around is in that um, middle two thirds where most of that has a good piece of metal in it. Um, but they are a lot lighter. The The tails are, are kind of, uh, the tails are really soft and the tail is kind of, um, kind of stiff, which makes them a really great playful ski in soft snow. Um, so I've had these in about um, eight or nine inches of powder and they floated pretty good for kind of a skinnier waist ski on a powder day at 102. And um, and uh, the, the tips keep on pulling you up and lifting you up. However, the nice stiff tail gets you lots of power. If you land something on your rear end, you were able to pop right back up. One of the things I've noticed since I was skiing the Mantras, the Mantra 102, um, is um, the swing weights way down. So when I'm doing uh, my favorite dad jump um, is what I call a twist uh, or a twister. My boys call it a shifty. You know, where you just churn at the hips, throw your skis sideways and come back. Man, when I did those with the mantra, I was never sure I was ever gonna get the ski back. These ones whip out and then come back really quick. And so I like that. One of the things I do miss is um, just charging through like mogul runs. Um, where those mantras would just blast through them, you know, kind of when you get at that tail end of the mogul run, you're just like, I, I don't have any turns left in me, and you just point it down the hill. The mantras were just tanks, and they would um, they would blow through. These ones, you will get some deflection because they are um, quite a bit lighter. But as far as just ripping turns and, and skiing really, really fast, I was I was really pleasantly surprised with how stable they are and how fun they are to do that. Um, they've got enough rocker in them. Um, where you could kind of play around and goof around and butter and slide and throw your skis sideways real quick, but still maintain your forward momentum. Um, so really a great all around ski. I would say this, if you're looking for just one ski to ski in the West, you want something that's going to be great on days when it's been a week since you got snow or it's been, or you're headed out there and they just got seven, eight, nine, ten 10 inches last night. This is a great ski. Another cool thing about this ski, and I think uh, it's a cool thing that Fisher is doing, and I think all ski companies should go ahead and do this. They make the, they, this is a unisex ski, so it's men's and women's, but what they do is um, they make it in two different colors. Here you've got kind of this navy blue with a little bit of orange on it. Um, it's, a, it's a great, you know, uh, dad ski color. Um, and, um, but they make um, a, them in a whole, um, size range. I think it goes all the way down to a 148, but they make it in a bright teal color that might appeal more to female skiers. I kind of like the teal, but I thought, oh gosh, you're 45 and you're a grandpa. Uh, so, you know, go with, go with the navy blue. And, uh, but I think that's something because they're, the buildup is identical and their women's and men's skis, which a lot of ski companies are doing now, which I think is the right thing to do. Length is the big thing and waist is the big thing. Uh, build up in a ski um, doesn't know if you're male or female. Um, but I think it's really cool that they offer it in two colors. One that might appeal more to men and one that might appeal more to women. And uh, I think more ski companies should fall in line with that. Anyways, that is my short and sweet review of 
the uh, Fisher Ranger 102. I want to say a big thanks to Fisher for hooking me up with really great ski gear and uh, had a lot of fun on these and uh, you should definitely check them out. If you do want to check them out, just hit that link and find me on Curated and I'll get you hooked up with a pair of these in the teal or the navy blue. Please do me a favor, hit like, send me a message, and most importantly, subscribe. Thanks so much and we'll see you next time uh, I get to review more ski gear or mountain bike gear. Have a great day. Bye.